Hey guys, thanks for joining us today. We're gonna to take a peek at Quaff's Helical Type LSD. Uh, we offer these in R200 and R230 applications. What that means in the catalog is everything from Z back to 90 on up through the Z, G, uh, some of the early Q stuff. <clears throat> uh, nice thing about Quaff is it's a really broad range of applications. Uh, I'd say our biggest, broadest section we're gonna talk about is like the 350 and up catalog. Uh, these are offered in an automatic or manual diff flange. What that means is they can accommodate all gear ratios that we offer in the catalog. Um, we have a, a nice write up on the gear listing there. I will try and get a link in for you and uh, try and help you understand what we mean versus auto or manual. But there's a 400 thousandths of an inch difference in the flange placement. You kind of can't cross that barrier with gears going one way or the other, okay? Uh, but we'll have you suited for that correct. The other really nice thing about Quaff is that it has uh, suitable options for uh, base differentials or manual differentials, and we even can work with you to kind of play the numbers on that to install a base in an LSD uh, with a specific stub. All that's on the site. So we've we've got options though for drop-in. If you had a base, you can just get it. You don't have to buy extra stubs. Your base stubs can work for the particular one. If you need one for an LSD, then you can either trim your long LSD stub or you know buy an additional short LSD stub to work correct, kind of how we have listed on the site there. Um, Performance-wise, these are a great, great diff for the street, kind of dual-use user. Uh, I'd say one of one of our most popular, really, uh, for that case, because they offer a silent operation. Uh, they're a one-way style, as all helical diffs uh, really are, which means that the biggest known uh, lockup performance is going to be, you know, under acceleration load. And it still will have a LSD characteristic on D cell. Um, really notable if you're going from a base open diff to uh, quaff is that even the dynamic, we're not talking about spinning tires out like a drift car, you know, just corner entry, uh, you know, at regular pace or an improved pace, you're going to notice that kind of the bite at the rear of the vehicle is improved, turn in is nicer, kind of carry through on a corner, the grip load is just improved, the car will hold the road better. And on corner exit, you can put more power down before you break traction. And if you find that you do manage to break traction, um, the lockup characteristics on the diff are uh, good enough that you can usually drive yourself out on, you know, throttle um, immensely better than you could on an open or really even, you know, a factory viscous. Uh, performance characteristic is going to stay consistent through the temp range, and these are backed with an exceptional warranty. Um, being a mechanical diff, it, it doesn't really change with temperature like we see with the viscous, um, which is nice. Uh, operation is really silent. Um, which for dual use street use vehicles is a huge, you know, huge gain. If you didn't want to tell your wife or girlfriend that you were putting a diff upgrade in your car or listen to her complain as the car hops and pogos and bounces around, you know, parking lots and stuff and you got folks staring at you because you got cool race car clip type discs in your car, you know, it, it's a really good fit and one of our most popular. So uh, we also offer helical in a wave track, but um, most options purely uh, from Quaff. You guys have questions, you know? Comment below, give us a call.